He who says he can and he who says he can't are both usually right. I remember I wanted to learn how to cut hair. And there was this guy called El Flo, and he told me, Levy, if you want to learn how to cut hair, you first need to learn how to cut your own hair. I was like, what do you mean? You want me, like, how am I going to give myself a haircut? It was like, you should learn. All you need is two mirrors. One in the front, one in the back. I tried it, I thought it was impossible, but I learned how to do it. And I got my diploma. I actually got my diploma as a professional barber. So basically everything is in the mind. The limitations that we put ourselves is that, ourselves, is the mind. I feel like with enough practice, with enough dedication, we can learn how to do anything, how to learn any language, how to, Whatever you want to do, you can learn it. You can practice it. You can master it. Today we're cutting our own hair. My name is Levi. 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 So, let me see. Oh, yeah. So I grab the bag right here. And then I start. Real nice. Nice, now you know. Keep going. You know, when I was a kid, and even as an adult, I wouldn't like the way the barber will, you know, trim my hair. They either did it too hard or I don't know, but it was always uncomfortable. And it came to a point where I, I said, well, you know what? I should learn how to do it myself. I feel like cutting hair is an art. It's a form of art because, you know, you form, you, you trimming. I was like, I like everything that has to do with art, so I want to learn how to do it. <laughs> and that's what I did. I, I rolled myself in the first. That lasted a few months. We had different models. I used to cut my friend's hair. I used to cut kids' hair for free. My my first my very first clip my grandmother uh, she gave it to me as a as a gift it was a wall a gray one and I used to give my friends free haircuts but it served me as practice you know I used to learn with their heads with their hair sometimes in life we put money first but money should never come first. Money. I'm pretty sure with this pandemic going on last year, a lot of people learn how to do certain things themselves. Since a lot of stores and shit was, was closed. So yeah.
final result of the haircut. I hope you guys liked the video. I had so much fun making it. And I've been doing this for quite some time. I do it very easily. But I'm pretty sure that if you guys try it, you'll get the hang of it too. Um, I had so much fun yesterday shooting that video. And I wanted to show you guys the results since my phone stopped recording and I couldn't show you the final results. But yeah, I'm very happy with the haircut. I'm very happy with it. I was getting it done myself. I would save that money. I would try to pay myself, you know? Make sure that money is there for me, for myself. This is one of the many things that I started to learn how to do my, on my own. And I feel like I'm not stopping. I also want to make furniture. I want to make uh, dining tables, uh, bookshelves, uh, beds. <laughs> I want to be able to like create a lot and make a lot of things so that when I get land, I can even build my own home. And you know, just getting a simple haircut like this helps you understand that everything is possible. I've visited several people that have already built things on their own, and it feels good when you surround yourself with things that came out of your mind. I don't know if that makes sense, but thank you guys for watching this video. I had so much fun uh, making it. And if you guys haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Um, it's lit. <laughs> Let's go.